Hi guys, I'm just going to get through this really, really quick. Today I got my Pop Sugar box in the mail. Yay, Pop Sugar. I've already opened it, so I already know what's in it, of course. Sorry, I'm filming at my store so you can see all my stuff in my case. Um, first thing is the wet hairbrush. And it has pretty soft bristles, which is kind of nice. Then there is a $20 gift card to Stitch Fix. I've never actually heard of this before, but it looks like uh, you complete a style profile and schedule a Stitch Fix. They send you up to five clothing and accessory items. You try it all on, figure out which ones you like, and send the rest back. So that's kind of cool. I might check them out. Um, next thing is some julep nail polish. It looks like a blue nail polish and then a top coat. I do love julep nail polishes, so this will be something that I use, and I'm pretty sure I don't have that color. We got some NYX liquid eyeliner as well as a NYX smoky eye palette. I will definitely use the eyeliner, but the smoky eye palette not really for me. That'll probably be a gift for someone. And this I was very excited about. Our food item for this month is from the Crispery, Crispy Cakes. And this is Halloween sprinkles, obviously. But it is a humongous Rice crispy treat. I haven't opened it yet, but it looks like there's tons of marshmallow in there and tons of sprinkles. I love Rice Krispie Treats, so that's going to be amazing. And we got little decorative type of bobby pins that have sparkles. I know you probably can't see it because it's getting glare from the lights above, but it is from Jane Tran. Just cute bobby pins. And we got something else from Georgiana and Griffin. And let me open it. Inside is a very, very cute bracelet. It is fluorescent pink with little gold beads. Um, this will definitely be something I will use. It's so cute. And then the very last thing in the box is the Can't Cook Book. It is by Jessica Seinfeld. I flipped through it and it actually looks like there's quite a few um, pretty cool recipes. It says 100 plus recipes. It also has sections in the book that tell you how to measure things and different temperatures for things. So it's kind of an awesome book, not like a regular cookbook. So this will probably be a gift for a friend who doesn't know how to cook very well. Um, there weren't a ton of recipes in here that I would like, but I'm sure other people would love it. So, very cool. I haven't figured out the retail value for the box yet, but as always, I will post it below. Um, thumbs up the video if you liked it, and subscribe below, <laughs> and I will see you guys later. Bye!